Well, what's going on guys, it's Rinton here, and I'm bringing you a nice 75 to 3 kill confirmed on Turbine. I know, recently all my good gameplays have been on Turbine. I think this is the reason just because it's like my favourite map. Uh, I think I've sort of the way I play, like, quite a long shotter, I think. More of a kill in my distance, stay out of the way, play a little bit better. I think that's kind of suits me, because I prefer the bigger maps. I don't know why I always have. And every Call of Duty, I think, I've just preferred the bigger maps. Oh man, he got lucky. So, kind of true, I've got two deaths already. It means I only get one death out of the rest of the whole game. And I haven't got one kill yet. So 75 to 1 is what it should be. Because I shouldn't have really got them two small deaths. Because they were pretty pointless. But anyway, that's enough of them. Um, I got asked to make a video. And I was like, hmm, do I have a gameplay? I was like, I'd search my computer. I come on across this. I thought, this is a long time ago, this is when I don't even have diamond weapons. This is when I'm like, loving the M8A1. I still love it, but... I don't know why, I just like the AN94 at the moment, and the... kind of like the M27 too. But, this is like, I pick this gun up, and I think I'll play the rest of the game pretty much with this weapon. And then I think that's when it decides me to think, I want it gold, and I want to hit the diamond weapons. So I'm like, I'm going to do this, I'm going to get diamond weapons, because using this weapon made me think, I actually really like this weapon, I want to use it more often. So I started using it, and then I eventually got it gold, and I was like, I've tried out whatever weapons, and I was like, ah, oh, screw it, I'm just going to smash myself and damage it and try and I'm hardest and get these di diamond weapons just because then I've got them and I don't have to try it. At a later stage, I mean, you little camper, just shoot it back ahead. I think this is like one of the only times I've actually played really well in Kill Confirmed, because recently when I play Kill Confirmed, I kill a couple people, collect a couple of tags, bush, get shot on the back. It's like, are you for real? You're killing me that quick already? Come on. Why'd you have to rush me all the time? I'm not into this. I'm into this slower pace, kind of... Control the area of the map. Maybe not rush too hard. No, just, just camping it, see? What will VSAT coming in handy? Free tag, and I don't even pick it up. Oh, get lucky. Could have, could have picked them all up, but... I thought I'd kill that guy before he kills the team member. This gun seems pretty good. And I'll probably go to use it in a minute. Because I'm going to finish commentary. I'm going to let it render out. And I'll go off to play. And I'm actually going to use it again. And see if I can actually play. Because recently, every gun I'm using, I kind of suck with. So it's like, I need to find a gun that actually works for me again. Because the M881 kind of isn't working at the moment. The M27 isn't working. The M94 is working. But only at certain times. It's kind of weird. So I'm like, screw this. I'm going to pick up another weapon, I'm going to explore, I'm going to see what I can do, see what I can find, see if there's any new combinations that I like, like this, this is uh, just the silencer I think, or is it just customised, I don't know, it's just got a silencer on it, but when I carry it, I carry silencer, grip, maybe stock, depending on what I want, see, oh there's the other death, see they've got my swarm, that's alright, pretty much half a gameplay with one gun, picked it up, raped with it, done well, and then I think after this game I'll go and use it, I don't do too well, I'm not sure. But anyway, I do want to start using this gun again just because look how sexy it looks. And obviously, everyone on my channel and everyone in the Call of Duty community that checks YouTube will have seen it diamond as well and definitely. Oh, go on, Swarm, go ham. You definitely know how sexy it looks with it being uh, diamond. It is like the best looking gun ever. By far my favourite. By far, I need to start using it again. Definitely. Definitely, definitely. Because I actually play well with it when I used to use it. I need to start playing with it again. I need to start playing well. I need to be getting these gameplays. Because quite frankly, in the last week or so, I've only got like one gameplay that's probably usable. And I think that was my 131 to 7. And that is currently going up over on the PS3 Team GBR channel. If you want to go check their channel out, I'll put an annotation on the screen right now. They have been invited to join their clan. Um, we've got some absolutely amazing players over there. Thrilled to be part of it. I think you should head on over there and check it out. For anyone that hasn't already heard about them, definitely subscribe and you'll see plenty of awesome gameplays. They've got some of the best gameplays I've seen by far on there. Uh, they've got 193 kills in one game. It was on Nuketown Demolition. He goes absolutely ham with his streaks. And it pays off. And it's definitely a good channel to be a part of. And definitely a good channel to be subscribed to. So I think you should head on over there. Annotation will be on the top left-hand corner right about now. So I think you should um, 
go and click it. Go check it out if you like it. If you love it, subscribe, like their videos. And I have a video going up there today at some point, I do believe. And um, it is 131 to 7. I took it down off my channel. Um, people ask why, where did it go? I said I took it down. Just I haven't said why, it's just I took it off my channel for a little bit. Just so it can go up there, be there for a while, and then I will unlist it again on my channel. It's just unlisted at the moment, and I'll just put it public again. Okay, that's all. Go ham. Hell yeah, that's what it's all about. Come on, Lodestar, do your work. So, yeah, it's a real good channel. Got invited to join, and I was like, checked them out, and I was like, yes, this looks beast. They've got some awesome players, they do nice. They're nice, they're chilled out, and they kind of just love the good gameplays, and that's I think that's what Call of Duty is about. The real good gameplays, and good strong commentators I'm not saying I'm the best commentator in the world or that I'm any good at it because quite frankly I do stutter quite a lot I probably repeat myself a hell of a lot through each game if you probably watch one video and then watch another video one after the other I'll probably repeat myself probably quite a lot of times and I'm not gonna lie I think I do but I guess it comes with practice the more you do it the better you get the more fluent you get the better quality you can get I don't want to get a new mic, but I like my mic at the moment. It works fine, it seems good quality, and that doesn't have a problem with it. But I do want to get like a nice bit bit more of a professional mic. I just don't know why I just do. But that might come in handy one day. But I've got other things to buy first. So I hope you've enjoyed this, guys. A little talk about my new clan that I'm part of. Go check them out, and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And I'll see you next time. This is Rintin. Peace out.